What's up y'all, welcome back to the channel. During this video, I want you to leave your thoughts and comments down below. I wanna hear the good things, I wanna hear the bad things, critiques, encouragement. I wanna see it all, cause I'm listening. I wanna make this content the very best that it could possibly be, and I can't do it without y'all. I also would like to hear what's your favorite part of the vlog, what's the most quotable part of the vlog. This video is gonna be epic. My big boy's first ever flag football game. He had a practice right before, led up to a game, he made us so proud, we're so happy, and we always gonna support our kids. Stay tuned for the very end of the video. It was trying to you know, tease my big boy. So we had to you know, get them together. So sometimes you gotta put people in their place, and that's how we do. With that being said, hopefully you enjoyed this very long video, and we'll see y'all at the very end. Love y'all, God bless. Let's get this video started, let's go. at the jewelry store. And I didn't know y'all, so I wanted to share this with y'all. I took my wedding ring off because as you can see, it was too small. I outgrew it, y'all, so. They do a thing at jewelry places, for all the guys out there or girls, where they can resize your original ring. I didn't know that. Did y'all know that? Let me know down below. Because maybe if I would have waited, maybe y'all would have told me that these in there uh, finishing up. So they actually cut your ring and add gold or metal to it and I increased like a size and a half in ring size, y'all. So I was a size seven when I got married, and now I'm an eight and a half. I wanted nine, but they was all going against me saying, you need eight and a half. It's, it's just enough room for you to, you know, swell up and go up and down with, you know, heat and all that stuff. I was like, I want a nine. Cause you know, I'm a nine and seven guy, September 7th, you know, I like numbers. So nine and seven has always been my number. So. It would be tight if I would've went from seven to a nine. But these girls, they feel like they know better than me. So they're gonna cut up my original ring, which is still cool, because I was gonna go the silicone route. They were saying that it's gonna deteriorate and it's gonna not last forever. It's not like gold and, you know. <laughs> no sentimental values with the original ring. What you think, big boy? The cutting? Yeah, everything. Rings. Oh, uh, rings. Yeah. I say they're pretty cool for marriage. Yeah, they're awesome for marriage. Look, look at the wife. Look at the wife. Why are you making faces at me? Cause I saw you filming me. I wasn't filming. I was filming me. Oh, you didn't get. You didn't close your door, right? Cause I'm not used to closing doors. How about you close it? I'll be back. Sorry about that. It'll never happen again. Mm -hmm. I apologize, you forgive me. Mm -hmm. I was explaining to them because oh, I didn't know that they would cut up rings and resize the uh, original ring. That's oh, crazy. That. Yeah, they can't do that. And they can't do it to like eternity bands because it's diamonds everywhere. That's you what I said I wanted. Setting. That's what I said I wanted and you won't let me get an infinity ring. No. A diamond studded all the way around like thick ring. Why won't you let me get that? That's what I want. VVS's what, and all you that. you got me? Yeah. No. Why? Why can't we have the same thing? Because. That's sexist. Sure. <laughs> hey y'all, please don't send this to my sister Trinice because she works, she worked in jewelry forever. And she's like, wow, how dare you not know that. Here we go. So are you still gonna order Amazon, the silicone, in the meantime, or are you just gonna wait two weeks? <sighs> that's, that's a tough decision, y'all. Y'all let me know, what, what should I do? It's like $10. I don't like, I don't like walk around without a ring on. Yeah. Cause it symbolizes my love for my wife. And at the altar, it said, touch when you feel lonely. So what would I do when I feel alone? When I don't feel loved? When I don't feel like wanted and needed and, and desired? What am I supposed to do? The guy said I'm supposed to touch the ring to feel all those things. What am I supposed to do? How wild of us? Go to bed. Out for our nighttime walk. Big boy's doing it. He's in control. He's doing amazing. Look at him, relaxed, confident, calm, energy. Let's cross over, Jared, go left. Now, how you feel, big boy? Good. You feel good? Feel confident, calm, relaxed? And we're gonna cross over again, okay? So come on. All right, y'all, just left out of Amazon Whole Foods. This is where I gotta get all my water refills. And then I got something, and here's something special, which y'all know about mochi, mochi. I got that mochi. Do you know what mochi is? 
Japanese ice cream. You learned something new today if you didn't know. Or if you're a fan, let me know. What's your favorite flavor? Oh, uh, mochi. It's warming up out here, y'all. It's warming up. Every time Jordan's birthday comes around, it's pretty much summertime. And of course, I park far away and this park right next to your boy. I just want my space, y'all. I just want like my own little area, nah. I park all the way in the back. Yeah, that's what your boy is looking like. These five gallon jugs in here. Up in the coop. Up in the coop. Up in the coop. Look, look at this guy. Look, look at this guy. Why is his truck sticking out like that? People park crazy here. Sheesh. 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 It's amazing how so many people, I'm thankful for it. So many people are checking back in on us, on this channel that haven't seen us in a long time. And the question gets asked over and over and over again. Why y'all take all the videos down? Why y'all, come on, man. I want to, oh, I'm sorry. I got to put my seatbelt on. I wanted to watch those videos. But when the video is up, man, I could see the analytics. Nobody was really watching them. But that's not the reason, though, because it's not about views. I just love starting things fresh. I love starting fresh. I love, I'm a zero to one guy. I'm not a one to two guy. I'm a zero to one. I like starting from the bottom. It, it, it's like a level of hunger that it brings out of me. That I just, ah, I love creating. I think it's, that's another side of art, of being an artist. Being an artist, it's about creating. And I'm more like the father who is my source. God is my source. So if I'm not creating, I'm not being like God. So I have to be more like Christ every single day of my life. So when things start getting comfortable, comfortable, I get uncomfortable. So I need to make everything uncomfortable so I could be uncomfortable and not comfortable because I know the best that I get out of myself is when I'm uncomfortable when I'm challenged I'm very high functioning I learned that from learning about my son he's a high functioning kid just like my Jordan high functioning I'm a high functioning daddy high functioning daddy let me whip it real fast Wow. Turn the radius on point. All right, now. Let me get up out of here, now. There's no funny devices in, in this car. They're, like, real small. But it worked. Get the job done. I'm thankful for the little things. <laughs> That's thankful for the little things right there. My vibes are little. My vibes are little. My, my, my vibes are little. My vibes are little. Ah, ah. My vibes are little. My vibes are little. Ah, ah. With my big boy, go and get his cleats. There's mommy, that's a girl's mommy. My big boy got his first big game tomorrow. No, oh wait. Tell me what you think about your first flag tomorrow. I feel like it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good? Are you excited? I'm excited. You are? You don't you sound excited. I know. I just wanna see him energy tomorrow. Oh, I wanna save energy. <laughs> Meanwhile, the girls over here, cuddle fest, as usual. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Goodness, girls. <laughs> Do you feel speed? I feel speed. How's it feel with your I feet? I think I have to try on um, our grass. Yeah, you gotta try it on grass, I know. You always supposed yeah. to have some room at the tip. You need room to, to Do you move. feel too tight or do you feel fine right now? Don't I feel worry fine about right now. Long, yeah, mommy's she just wanna stunt and ball on out on everybody. What? And get a new period every single season. 
What are these? Who's she? Who's that? Who's that? I don't know. You don't know her? Oh. It's a half size bigger. I told my wife I'm gonna do one red, one blue. Be extra extra. Yeah, yeah. I think it's clean. Okay, Ooh, we got more speed with the one color each foot. <laughs> one's fire, one's ice. It's like your Roblox character. Yeah, yeah but this Which one doesn't one? have a half size better. That's the only size they have in blue. Uh, so yeah, you wanna do all red? Which one do you You look good in red. Better, I like the red one better. Huh? You run like a mom. What do you think? Which one feels more comfy? <laughs> <laughs> do you want both? I don't remember mouthpieces like this. They got fruit punch? Like, what, what are they? They give you flavors now? That's crazy. So we're looking at this one for Jerry. I remember having to boil mine in a pot of hot water. And that one says you don't have to boil it. Ready to use out of the package. It's all new. This is required for him for his game tomorrow. Look, what about these water bottles, man? You gonna need one of these squirt bottles? All I know. You hear me? All I know is nobody gotta be hitting myself nowhere in town. Which mean he gonna be hitting people, Ronnie Lott style, Steve Atwater style. Hmm? What about this water bottle squirting his mouth? <laughs> when you come to the sideline, you don't touch. He goes. <laughs> I fill you up. Somebody mess with you, you tell mommy. Look at these. Look at these Gatorade bottles. See, this is what you need. Pro style. Open your mouth, boy. Open your mouth, boy. Mm -hmm. That's how I'm gonna squirt water in your mouth. I'm gonna I get him one of these, baby. A blue one. Messes with him. You tell mommy uh, where on the sideline. I see you. You gonna go on the field, huh? I don't think I need one of these. Yeah, it's a water bottle spray. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> it's good for squeezing water into your mouth when you're on the field. There's you don't want a water bottle? Here. I don't need a water bottle. Okay. Just get my normal water. Oh, excuse me. What's up, my Joe? How you doing, my Joe? Good. How you feeling? Good. What? Good. <laughs> Why do you talk like that? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Good. Say Mexico. Mexico? <laughs> I got your shoes in my head. You want to throw the football? You say the cutest. Hold the football. Ever. Hold the camera. What the? That was terrible. That was a terrible throw. <laughs> Yeah, you chose that? No, he gave it. I was scared. It's mommy's number. Run, baby, run, 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 run. Woo! Woo! Nice. Say, practicing flag, taking the flag drills. Oh, almost, Jay. Almost, Jay. Almost. Stay with it. Good, Jay. Go, Jay. Ooh. Close. Good job, big boy. Don't be timid, okay? You just yank it. You hear me? You yank that flag. Yeah, it's your first time, but I'm proud of you. I yeah. saw you. Yeah, that's awesome. You're out here learning, babe. First turn, crossing route. Go. Bam. Go a little high. Almost, almost. Jay, Jay, nice. Yeah. Good catch, Jay. Good job, Jay. Good job, Jer. Finish strong. Go, 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 go. <laughs> there you go. Good catch. Good throw, Jer. Ooh. So they do a practice, and uh, you know they saw my big boy throw the ball, and they got him at quarterback. You know, <laughs> little Jeffrey Breeze out there. And put the picture of him crying next to Breeze. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do it like that. Okay, yeah, I see your daddy practice skills paying off. I think he played quarterback, yeah, and the guy behind him playing uh, running back. Cool. So yeah, he let all the little kids uh, throw, 
And then he was like, oh, he was impressed by Jerry's arm. Get up. I'm not surprised. He likes it. All right. Blake, Captain. Good team. Blake, you know what's <laughs> Jerry, you ready? You guys ready? You have it right All right. Got this. <laughs> the down marker. <laughs> All right, Jer. Never did uh, markers before. <laughs> Go go! Back it up, back it up, Jake. Ball, 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 ball. No, you did. You did. You you threw the best pass and you caught it with one hand. Yeah. So you guys both were like on a legendary play. You did amazing, babe. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. For your first time? That was just incredible. First time, man. I'm proud of my son. And of course, you know, I'm competitive. So, you know, I'm thinking about, you know, improvements and different things. It didn't count though. It was a scrimmage. No, it counted to me. Okay? It still didn't. Everything counts to me. So, it's good plays counted. Okay? The first game wasn't bad. I was just getting to meet my people, and it's fine if I don't have a W. And I think my teammates did pretty good, and we're gonna you're gonna do better next time. So, parent perspective, I think my son did amazing. Yeah, There's that. one thing you were like, come on. I was like, don't, yeah. don't, don't do that. And Jared, next time when a boy says, I'm taller than you, say, and. Yeah, say, I'm better than you. Say, I'm smarter than I'm you. I'm faster than you. <laughs> My parents are cooler than yours. My house yeah. is better. <laughs> Our cars are faster. What? <laughs> I got more money in my bank account than you. <laughs> That's How what you that say. They, they don't know your parents. We're going to teach you. they trying to roast my big boy. Tell me, <laughs> yeah, both your parents grew up with that. We know how to handle that. <laughs> and oh, please let somebody say you got a big head. Say which one. <laughs> That's what you say, son. You hear me? <laughs> say, yeah. say, I could play piano better than you. I could run faster than you. I could do anything better than you. Yeah, we got to teach our son how to hold his own because yeah. he a boy did that. Went up to him, was like, I'm taller than you. And Jer, sweet Jer, he just, he didn't say anything. Yeah, no, nah, we could teach her how to put that dog in, you know. <laughs> I could teach you the, 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 the vocabulary. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let R.I.P. get into my child now. <laughs> Daddy's going to be uh, out there wilding. Have, have a little boy out there crying. Play if you want. <laughs> Run into their mommy and daddy. Yeah, he said something so crazy to me. I could teach you. Kia, Kia. Let's joke. We could joke. We could pull up all kind of stuff that you better than these boys at if they want to talk trash. Yeah, da uh, Jer, daddy has had to put some people in his place. Uh -huh. uh, all over the world. Yeah. Canada, Europe, <laughs> South America. You did tell her to stay in Canada. Stay in Canada. I did tell her, didn't I? <laughs> She ain't learned a lesson. I told her. Video, we really appreciate y'all tuning in to the very end of this video. Let me know down below, what was your favorite part of this vlog? What was your favorite line out of this video? I would love to, to read those down below. I'm definitely reading. I'm definitely listening, trying to make these videos better and better and better. Hopefully you're enjoying the long content. Make sure you follow us on all our social media platforms on Instagram at Queen D Fitness. That's my beautiful wife. She's awesome. You definitely should follow. 
Thank you for following us on TikTok. We have a lot of fun over there, great content on TikTok, at the Levines. Make sure you follow us on all our platforms. Until next time, stay safe. Look out for all those in your four walls. God bless you. We'll see you next time. Peace.